what's up everybody we're about to do a tire change for our zx6r this is the old tire as you can see the thread on the old tire and this is the new tire so let's get started we'll show you the whole process of how to get this thing done socket this and this this is uh, I think 3.4 this 1.2 yeah. Yeah. Uh, we don't have to take out all. You just have to. You have to loosen the screws. Yeah. These are the screws. Yeah. Those little that's right there. Brake levers. A screw right there. For a brake lever, we have to take it out. You have to hold the blade, I mean the caliber, because we want to give pressure on the pipe, the hose. So it's coming out. I think it's gonna come out all the way. If it's not on the stand, it's gonna go down. Oh, okay. So our camera died, so we switched to another camera. So now I'm showing you guys the other side. While he's twisting one side, he's holding one other side. As you can see, the top. Very light. Yeah. See. Oh my God! It's so <laughs> light. I did not expect this at all. You just have to hold the wheel a little bit up and take out the middle you have thing. To push the wheel up and yeah. take you have out to hold the it. middle. You have to hold it, okay? Because when you take out this, and it will come out. It's that easy. Now uh, we're gonna go cycle gear and. Uh, I'll show you the tire once again. Uh, can you hold it for me? As you can see, there is a tremendous amount of tread that is missing. I'm gonna get out of the way. Let's show you. Guys. You see the, the difference? One. That's 50 50 right there. There's one side is just gone, the other side is not. We have no idea what the case was for that. We did some research and we couldn't really get any concrete answer. So, but. We have decided to change the tire, and this is the new tire. This is this can you is tell the brand uh, and everything. Bridgestone. Bridgestone. Yeah. This is a Bridgestone. The tire. same one, uh, because I need the same pattern. You know, the same. It's the same tire because his front and the back tires are the same company and same pattern. So you wanted to keep it the same way. But the only thing is the tread is brand new. You can see the dips, and you can see the difference right here how big of a difference that is. So now we're gonna go to cycle gear to get it mounted. Yeah. Onto this. And then we will put the tires back on. And also quick on a side note, the brake lever, you're supposed to not let it hang. So make sure you just tie it up, keep it up. So that way it doesn't hang. Because if it hangs and the air gets into this pipe, 
then you will have bubbles in your brakes and your front brake would not work properly. So to avoid that, just keep it hung so that way it does not affect the front brake. So guys, we came to Cycle Gear and they did not have time to mount our tires. Today. So we will be going to another spot that we found nearby and we will see if they can do our mounting of the tires. So we have arrived at this spot, living good. Motorsports, motorcycle performance and repair. This They're gonna do our tire mounting for $27.99, which is only $2 more than cycle gear, but they're gonna do it right away. And we got some motorcycles over there. Maybe we'll take a look at those as well. And there we go. So guys, these, guys, these motorcycles are not for sale, but these are beautiful motorcycles that we cannot go and see from the inside. I wish I could, but they got a nice little collection over here and which I'm excited to see from far, but not close, but you know, we love more cycles, so it's all good. So it goes over here. Okay. So when you take out the wheel, don't forget to put it back. Uh, before you put it back, degrease it. Yeah, just clean it. Well, you don't need any grease as the boss man has said it. Boom. 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 So, can you hold it for me? No. This is a new tire. I got you. Oh. <laughs> bro, that's why I told you to hold it, bro. Everything's okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, we're back at it again. School we're about to insert down. this. Yeah. Now, this is another thing that will go in later on. Now, he's about to put in the tire, align it to the center to the circles and as you can see the brakes are up here that will be aligned after that there you go so this is the second part that we had taken out earlier the big pipe goes in first in layman's term the big pipe goes in first and then the a small turn will go. We will do the same process. We will hold one side while twisting the other side. And that's how it will work. Uh, the tire costs like $99. Okay, the tire itself, the cost of the tire was $99. The mounting of the tire was another $27. So in all together it was about $128 with taxes and everything, probably 130, 30 something dollars. Which is still not bad for the front tire, to be honest. And you got a pretty nice tire. This is stock tire though. Yeah, it is original stock tire. So he bought the same tire that he had previously on this bike, just to match to the back side of the bike, so. Which is a good deal, no lie. The person at the store told us in first hundred miles you should not do any hardcore curving going through the curves or leaning too much you should let it ride and let it get it adjusted first and then you can lean and do all the good stuff that you want to do as you're turning the thing just make sure the tires align straight so it'll be easier for you to screw it's almost in we're almost done So once it's screwed in, we're almost done. The last two things are to put these brakes back on and then we will be done. So we actually put these two. So on the side note, you're also supposed to screw these two little screws back, tighten them up. Once you have adjusted this middle part, you tighten these screws up. Uh, as earlier, we had loosened them up to get these middle parts out. Now these middle parts are back in, so we tighten them back up. Now is the break. Yes. The only thing left to do at this point is putting these brakes back on. And that should be it. It should be a pretty simple task to do. Well, this this, this is a sign right here. Literally, Ali and Sean, subscribe to us. It will be well appreciated. We'll appreciate that if you guys can subscribe to our channel. 
on Instagram. Follow us on Instagram. Subscribe to us on YouTube. Hit hit the bell icon. Back to the show. Just do the last minute checkups on the bike. Make sure all the screws are tightened. Make sure the rotation is good. Uh, that's all we have for today, folks. Uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the bell icon, and we will see you guys in the next one. Leave a comment below if you guys have any questions. Thank you so much for watching. Boop. What's up, everybody? We're about to do an oil, not oil change. Shit. What's up, everybody? We're about to do a tire change for our Kawasaki. What am I?